empty backfield again for the Chippewas. Now Kobe Lewis comes in and flanks his quarterback. Moore. Steps up. Pressure comes knocking the football out. It's a fumble. And it looked like the Canes jumped on top of it. And that was Gregory Rousseau who, as I mentioned earlier, he's playing D-end or he's playing inside. He lined up over the center on that one and forced that fumble. Watch right here. He makes a great move and gets right around this guard. Right here, he gets that rip in perfect positioning by that outside hand. You don't always have to tackle the quarterback, but if you can get the ball out and, and have fun. Second down and seven. Hooker with plenty of time and now sacked by Rousseau. He leads the team now with his fourth sack of the season and at 6-6 he can reach out and get those quarterbacks dusty well this young man is a physical freak we're going to see him working inside he's going to come all the way across i mean sorry he's working on the outside right there just gets a bull rush gets up the field he's 6-6 he's 260 pounds another third down gregory russo get to the quarterback he has been a menace for miami's defense with pressure coming and Perkins gets away but now the ball's on the ground Miami forces the fumble Perkins somehow got it back it was Russo who did swat the ball away and is he playing a heck of a game Perkins got away once but not from Rousseau, who with his helmet, I think, basically knocked that ball away. Perkins did well. Empty formation, and now they set the back Davis. Great pass protection, pickup block by Davis on the edge there. A guy like Shaq Quarterman for the Hurricanes. Pickett steps up and is sacked on the play by Rousseau. Third down and long now. Nice surge off the edge. Second sack of the day. He's going to be coming off your screen here, off the edge. Just beats the tackle. What I love, second time today, when he gets to the level of quarterback, young pass rushers, when you get to that level and the quarterback steps up, shut your rush down, retrace your steps, and he gets a nice sack. Third down and a mile. Another sack for Miami as Hornybrook ends up buried by Greg Rousseau. Rousseau had three sacks last week in the win against Pitt, and he's all over Hornibrook in the first quarter here. Look at Rousseau. They line him up over the center. They get him on the guard, and then his athleticism and strength on the delayed blitz by the linebacker, you put the defensive end. 2000s, they have been looking for answers to run their program and haven't found them. Hornibrook under pressure. The Miami pass rush gets home again. Rousseau and Ford. Garvin there as well, the fourth sack. This time it's on Reed for Akers. And he is met in the backfield and wrapped up, and he goes nowhere. Pat Bethel was able to make the stop. Rousseau through there as well. Rousseau's a special player. Top 10 in the country in sacks. He's talented, he's athletic. He's got an outstanding motor. This comes a little bit more to me about some play calling and, and stopping or staying out of third and 15 pluses. Here comes the rush again, and down he goes again. Tripped up by guess who? Greg Rousseau. Four sacks for Gregory Rousseau. And eight for Miami as a team. Wow. But this is some of the simple stuff of football. If you're in an offense that is staying in third and long, the defense knows you're doing one thing. Here comes a pass, and Rousseau, another nice job by Manny Diaz of moving him inside. And he knows it's a pass. You give him a two-way go, another sack for this defensive line. Maybe to take advantage of excellent field position from the Miami 39, and Harris will be sacked. And that was Rousseau. Eric, you talked about Big 15 at the top, and he's at work early. Yeah, he is at work, and he's working against number 63, Jacob Mont 
a true freshman. That is a freshman on freshman matchup. And Greg Russo at 6'6", 260 60 pounds, is a prototype defensive end. He, his name will be called early in the draft, and we will see him play on Sundays. Harris throws that ball right away. He's got the throw, but hesitated, and Bandy's able to get there. They'll throw here on third and ten with a pocket collapsing, and Rousseau is the benefactor of the good pursuit that Miami had from Trayvon Hill. Interesting sequence, Eric. As you said, those two passes creates a third and long, and once again, Monk just not able to, to keep Rousseau from getting in the back. Griffin Bear, 28 catches, and there's a ball popped loose after Smith was sacked. But he's going to be sacked on the play, and that's Rousseau getting to the quarterback for the first time today. Nine. And here's Smith looking to throw again. Up in the pocket, and they got him around the shoe tops. And it looked like Rousseau again, who's been a problem for Louisiana Tech. And Rousseau is shaking up on the play.